Welcome to the Alan and Zara Weekly Update. Uh, coming off a not a bad weekend, just the barriers probably cost us a few races on the weekend, but unfortunately that's the way it goes. And uh, heading to Saturday Mooney Valley with some you know some really good chances. We've got uh, Big Jill going around, um, terrific run there the other day. Did a lot of work, sat outside the leader, and probably the fitness told in the end, but going extremely well and looks like a nice race for her. Got Spelldowns going around for her 13th run this preparation, but her form uh, is fantastic. First first time at the Valley over 2,040 and drawn an inside gate. She should get there doing no work, and we know how much she loves the Valley, and she can get a kick off that corner. She'll be hard to run down. Seagull liaisons just come back from the farm. Uh, looks a lot better. Looks a bit rounder and, you know, looks really good in the coat. So she's just drawn wide, but probably that suits her, the way she, the pattern of racing for her. Uh, loves the valley and, and uh, a mare in good form. Off to Werribee. Uh, Spell Rocker hopefully gets a run. Um, going really well. Just hoping she can get into the race. She just, just is a bit slow away, not getting into the races. But if she can get in the race, uh, she'll be, she'll be right in the finish. Got um, Game of Shadows in the same race. Uh, talented horse, just probably needs a little bit to go his way, but uh, he's drawn a touch awkward as well. So, but if he can get a, a nice run, he'll be he'll be thereabouts. Uh, Matthew's heading off to the Easter Sale this weekend, and uh, you know there'll be plenty of high price ones, but there's been plenty uh, out of there that around the hundred grand mark. So, uh, if you still haven't got into a yearling, uh, look on our website. There's still plenty there, and uh, if we get a nice yearling, just we'll have a look at the results and. Uh, hopefully can, everyone can jump back into one. All right, until next week, I'll see you later.